Okay. All right, got it rinsed off a little bit. I'll do it more. Rinse a little better when I get back. Um, rinsed off my rods a little bit. I want to show you guys something. I don't know if you can see this. I'll take my hat off and camera's mounted onto this hat. Show you this is a new castaway I bought. Let's see what it says here. It is a mag medium heavy line weight 8 to 17, lure weight quarter to three quarter ounce, seven foot. And in the store, in the store, it's called a carbon extreme. Um, it looked bluer than it did purple, which is fine. It's got ten little micro eyes on it. And let's see, I've already bent one. No, they're all bent that way. Okay. And I decided that I needed one little stiffer one for popping corks, stuff like that. And I stuck a curator on it. It's okay. It's a uh, I don't really like the balance of it. I'm not used to the light handle. I like the cork handles. My favorite, which I've had forever, and this is probably before Castaway sold out. I heard they did several years ago. I've had this rod like 20 years. Maybe not that long. This is a, an old SLCS H7 saltwater light cast, 8 to 14 pounds. And you can see I've got it with like 15 pound mono and uh, oh, that's fluorocarbon there. You can see the knot there. Um, <clears throat> I've caught more fish off this rod and this old Calcutta 200 than pretty much anything I've ever used. Because I just keep going back to it. I like the real fast tip on it. Uh, it swings the light bait very well. And this is Debbie's favorite rod. She's got a castaway or two, but she likes this pink ugly stick. And as far as I'm concerned, it's ugly. It's a two piece rod, but it's kind of buggy whip action. But she's caught some good fish on it. I've got a Shimano Sedona on it. I don't know what number, looks like a 2500. Yeah. And she loves it, and she and she I think she likes it because of the small butt. <laughs> I'm not even going to say anything else. Um, it doesn't get caught, you know, down here in the midsection. Like if you stick your stomach out, <clears throat> not that her sticks out. Um, this is her other. She's got a, another castaway here that she uses. A, I've got one just like it. It's a new one, SLX3. Light action spinning. Eight 14 pound line, uh, quarter to half ounce. A little weight. And she's got a little Shimano Sienna on here. I don't really like these Siennas, but until they wear out, I'm not going to buy new ones because she has a tendency to throw rods in the water. Yes, she's done that. <clears throat> don't ask me how or why it happened, but she did one time. Um, my other one that I like, I've got, this is the same rod that she has, that GFS SLX3, but I've got a Stratic 4000 on it, and that's really a jewel. Really isn't for that bait, but I didn't feel like swapping baits too much today, so I loaded up a bunch of rods. And we tried these bucktail jigs, like John Skinner says, and uh, yeah, I put some strips on the back of them, but water was so muddy, so much wind, but they didn't do much. We didn't catch any flounder on those. Um, I, I tried an ugly stick today. This is the first time I've used it. Um, notice that, and that's cool. Um, I take all the reels off, put all my rods together, and hold them together with these. Anyway, I've got a Calcutta 200B on this with braid and fluorocarbon, <coughs> and it, it did pretty well for that heavy, heavy one. I catch anything on it but I could cast that heavy lure with it fairly well I'm not uh, completely opposed to ugly sticks for the money they're really good rods um, 
anyway that's what we brought this time I just wanted to and here's another ugly stick I think yeah this, she's got another little pink ugly stick and uh, another Sienna 2500 on it a little heavier than GX but these are my two go-to rods now I like this one a lot this is my baby and of course I've got the other with the Stratic on it over here the um, SLX3 worked it out pretty good but this one so far first time I've used it I caught it on sale at Academy um, it was like 109 it was uh, like 99 which surprised me didn't really care I was just gonna buy it anyway because I thought it was blue when matched my boat but it's actually more purple than blue so okay guys I'll do some more later and we'll talk <laughs> Thank you.